Today we'll be learning about insects and art and learn about a special artist. Maria Marian was a naturalist and a scientific illustrator who was born in Germany in the year 1647, 373 years ago, during a time when people believed that creatures that go through metamorphosis or change the way that caterpillars do into butterflies were evil. It might seem strange to us today to think of bugs and butterflies as evil, but people just didn't understand and they were scared. But it's because of Maria Marian's work that people no longer are afraid. Maria became a scientist, artist, and an explorer who made discoveries about insects, plants, birds, and reptiles that she shared with others in published books that included her beautiful art. She traveled to South America with her daughter during a time when most women didn't get to travel or explore. Stay tuned for a read aloud to learn more about her. Summer Birds, The Butterflies of Maria Marion. Illustrated by Julie Pashkis and written by Margarita Engel. Summer Birds was a medieval name for the mysterious butterflies and moths that appeared suddenly during warm weather and vanished in the fall. Each year, the sky fills with summer birds. Many people call them butterflies. Everyone believes that these insects come from mud, as if by magic. I disagree. I am only 13 years old, but I capture insects. I study them. I have to catch my insects in secret. Neighbors would accuse me of witchcraft if they knew. Everyone says insects are evil, but I know my summer birds are beautiful and harmless. I keep caterpillars and summer birds in boxes and jars. I feed the caterpillars with leaves. I sit still, I watch. Caterpillars are born from eggs laid by summer birds. The caterpillars eat leaves and they grow and eat some more. When the caterpillars are big enough, they spin cocoons. These are made of silky threads. While the caterpillars rest inside their silky cocoons, they turn into summer birds. The summer birds come out of their cocoons with wings ready to fly. Then they fly from one flower to another, sipping nectar. I know the grown-ups are wrong about summer birds. Insects are not born from mud. I have seen their whole life cycle with my own eyes. Insects grow slowly, changing from one form to another. None of the forms are evil. I love to paint colorful pictures of every kind of caterpillar, cocoon, and summer bird. I keep a notebook filled with my paintings. I write down everything the summer birds do. In my paintings, I always show which kinds of leaves the caterpillars eat. I also paint the flowers where summer birds drink nectar. Sometimes I think I am like a summer bird waiting to fly. Right now, I'm a child, but in a few years, I will be grown. When I'm a grown-up, I will be free to travel to faraway lands, painting all sorts of rare summer birds and flowers. Maybe I will even paint the lizards and frogs of faraway lands. I have some tadpoles in a jar of water. I have seen how they are born from eggs, not from mud. I watch the tadpoles eat and grow until finally when they are big enough, they begin to grow legs. The tadpoles have turned into frogs. Someday I will put my paintings into a book. Then everyone will know the truth about small animals that change their forms. When people understand the life cycles of creatures that change forms, they will stop calling small animals evil. They will learn as I have by seeing a wingless caterpillar turn into a flying summer bird. Hope you are inspired by Maria Marion's work and story. Watch the next videos for steps on how to get started on your own insect art.